Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to Transport Fever. I'm your host, Nexus, and, well, last time around, we worked heavily on a uh, massive expansion um, of the lines into uh, these intersecting cities uh, over here to West Covina and then um, into West Chaston from uh, Provo, which was eventually going to go into Sacramento and then off into Austin and back around probably to Minneapolis, and then this will be fed by the bus line. Uh, today... Um, we're going to do train enjoyment. We're going to ride the lines of the stuff that we built. Uh, the new freight network, which um, I went ahead and I already recorded it. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to add it as an end time lapse at the end of this video. Because today we're just going to put the trains on the lines and maybe run it at a medium speed and try and get things uh, laid in to start producing our materials. Um, and uh, we'll go over that. Why don't you join me after the intrepid intro and uh, we'll get that underway. All right, welcome back once again. Now, uh, as I said, we're just going to start adding trains to the lines, and we're just going to kind of, you know, follow them along, do a little ride-along kind of thing deal going. All right, so what's going on is what's going on. All right, we have a train that's going to start from fuel, and it's going to drop it off over here at Hub A. We're going to have a food train pick up from here, and it's going to drop off at Hub A, and this is going to shunt back and forth between here to Hub A. Right? Right. Uh, and then there'll be a train or two that'll pick up from Hub A and it'll transport out to Hub B. And then I've already got two lines called Double City uh, Freight 1 and Double City Freight 2, which will go from here to here to here and then from here to here out here to Hampton. And that's two different trains. And what that's going to go across is the uh, the freight triangle, which you guys saw. Set, which you guys, for those of you who want to see the setup, I will attach it to the end of this episode. Uh, and then you can see it from here. But yep, let's uh, let's get that underway. I'm gonna go all the way back over here to the to the depot because everything's connected up to the way that we can actually we don't have to have different depots. This one should do fine. All right. So the first thing I want to mention is that for the double city freight, we're going to be running multiple trains on those routes. So they're not going to be very long. They're going to be somewhat shorter trains because there's going to be uh, two or three of them running those lines uh, constantly. So uh, that's going to be interesting. We've got 70.6 million. Let me show you the thing here. I've already spent last year on vehicles 1.68 million, but that's probably stuff that renew. Oh, that's uh, that's um, the road vehicles. I already set up all the road vehicles in the towns across the way over there to accept the freight that's going to be generated on these lines. Uh, so we're down 767,000 already this year. We're down 759,000 last year. Up 6.64 million prior, year, the year before, and 7.29 million the year before that. Our income right at the moment is well, last year it was 29.9, and our running costs were 22.9. So, but I used all that money to set up everything. So, yeah, that's kind of how we're kind of where we're at right now. I want to take a look at the profitability on the lines. As you know, I like to have it what's making us the most at the top, what's losing us all the money at the bottom. As you can see, we're we're losing some money. Not it's not much because we're making way more in profit than uh, to cover that loss. So the Galactica jumper is seems to be the making the most money. Uh, 1.24 million, we'll say 1.5 because I just saw it 1.6 something every seven minutes. And the Durham fuel line is making us one point something every, uh, 1.2 every seven minutes. And then the blue line tagging in behind uh, at 636 every seven minutes and the stone road freight actually making us a decent amount of profit every 34 seconds and this is the rate the throughput rate of uh, the station per year so that's not too bad this could be doing a little bit better 112 it's not that great but it could be it could be worse uh, so we'll let that kind of do its thing for a moment and then decide what train all right so the first train is going to be fuel so it needs to be something pretty heavy duty i would have thought let's see that's 50 this is 60 and it's going a pretty long way we'll do this guy <clears throat> we're going to take you <coughs> excuse me and go to wagons and there's our wagon so we're going to take fuel or one Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. We'll say ten. That's that's decent. Um, we're gonna say you're gonna go. You're hub to hub. I would have thought. Fuel to hub A. Right. We may have to end up putting two trains on there, um, just to get things going. Um, 
well, to get things going faster, uh, rather. Now, why would you go there first? It's interesting, to say the least. I don't know why you think, why you felt it necessary. That's nice. I was not ho I wasn't expecting to get the EMD GP9 until later, but uh, we'll take it. Uh, we're gonna ride along, this guy. Um, we're gonna kind of go back up here at the camera so you guys can see what's going on. I'm not sure exactly why he chose to go this way first, but I'm not gonna fight and argue with him. You'll notice that this station is a lot bigger now. Um, I didn't actually get that on the time lapse uh, a lot of this uh, some of the stuff i just did off camera because you know you've seen it a thousand times you don't need to see it again i want to actually you know keep you guys in the action to keep you you know entertained and you know engaged that's the goal from now on is to keep you engaged and entertained in each one of the videos by showing you the action instead of the tedious bits uh, as you'll notice in the machine key playthrough it's all a quick build every episode has been a quick build and then some train enjoyment at the very end um Num season four is probably going to be like that too it's going to be heavily edited down which means that a lot of the stuff is going to be done off camera and the stuff that is on done on camera is probably going to be time lapsed most of the time and then we'll have some train enjoyment and stuff you know after that for you know 10 15 20 minutes or so so this guy is going to go all the way out he's going to stop because someone's blocking him oh he's got oh someone in front of him because we're waiting on passengers well, that's going to take a minute to to get going. Let's 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 kick it into high gear here so we can get stuff going. I'd really like to to ride this out each one of the trains. I'd like to ride out each one of the trains on their first journey. <clears throat> I'm sure you would like to as well. I know it's going kind of fast, but we have a lot of trains and stuff to get through. Um, there's quite a few trains that are, you know, initially going to use this line to get onto their respective tracks and after that they won't be coming back here again. But uh, until then, things are going to be moving right along. All right, so you're going to have to stop. And then we're... Oh, that guy. That train, that train, that train. Oh, why did you have to wait the whole time to get out there? I don't... Oh, because you're on that side of the track. Right. Right. Okay, well, I might have to put something in there then, possibly. No, we'll just leave it there. We'll leave it. It's fine. I don't want to get too far away because you guys actually want to be able to see the action, right? Here we go again, having to stop. This shouldn't happen too too often, I would have thought. Um, we can always put sightings in as well if we need to. Um, that's a thing. I've not had to do it thus far in Transport Fever. Um, sightings aren't really used a whole lot, but... I mean, we could we could get them in there if we need to. So, you're going to keep going. Hopefully you don't have to stop too many more times along the route because that would be a that would be a shame. I'm hoping the guy in front of you is, you know, enough in front of you that we're not going to have to worry about it a whole lot. Yeah, he's over there, so good to go. So, there we go. Actually, I can just use these keys. Right. Oh, look at that. Sorry, I didn't mean to have to make you stop there, Brian. Or uh, there, buddy. But, you know, it goes... Oh, we're going to take the passenger line? I thought we were... I would have thought we would have went around. Uh, pretty sure that, uh... Oh, no, I don't want to take the passenger line. No, 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 no. Uh, okay, so... You're going from there, and you need to go... Uh, you need to hit here. And then on your way back, you need to hit this one. There you go. Uh-huh. There we go. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. 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 Mm -hmm. There we go. There we go. All right, good. Uh, no, I want the train, if you don't mind. If it's all the same to you. There we go. Okay, so we're carrying 180. First load, and it's full. It's not too bad. It's not too shabby at all. There we go. I don't want you in the passenger line because then you'll just start to clog things up, and we don't want that. So, so enjoy our digital train set from a from a, from a nice view of up here. There we go. And are you long enough to fit between the signals? You are. Okay. Goody goody goody. 
All right, so now we're back to uh, where we started with this guy. So now we can put a new train on. And we'll go here. And it's a food train. So we'll say... Oh, what do you need? Uh, we'll do... Do we need... Well, we don't need one of those. Uh, maybe? No. We'll do one of these. Uh, we'll upgrade it later if we need to. We'll say... You're going to do food, so that's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. That's good. All right. And that needs to be food to hub A. And then we'll follow you along. Your first little voyage. It obviously makes sense for you to go that way the first time because you're going to the food network. I wonder why the other guy didn't go the other way. It's kind of interesting. But, you know, it is what it is. That's neither here nor there. Alright, so you're going to pick up absolutely nothing because nothing is needed yet, right? So, there's the boxcar train, and a lot of stuff is saying it needs to be replaced, but I'm pretty sure a lot of stuff is on is on auto-replace. Okay, so we're down. Ooh, 19.3 million last year, the year before. 2.36, 12.8 this year. This stuff is going to have to start paying off very quickly, or we're not going to um, we're not going to have any money left. What I might end up doing is I might end up sending, I might not end up putting any tra any more trains on um, until these start to make me money, because as of right now they're not making me any cash. Goes that, and then we need uh, we need two trains, one for each double city, well, each for one double city, or the uh, one for each double city. All right, so let's say we want um one, and then we'll say we want. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, and then we want one, two, three, four, five, and one, two, three, four, five. Right. Okay. And then I want to duplicate that. Ooh, not enough money. Um. Well, that's just uh, that's just too bad. Duplicate. Thank you. Now we really don't have any money. All right. This is gonna go double freight city and this is going to go double city freight 2 right and now we're broke <laughs> um, we're going to be broke for a little bit at least um, we're going to have to borrow some money to make the other freight train as well which uh, kind of sucks so i'm really hoping that the stuff that we're doing is going to you know be pulling us out of the gutter because if not well oof that's bad three point that's even starting to go drop really fast but it it's, it's going to be iffy. We're taking a chance here. I mean, we can always sell some of the trains back if we need to, but, you know. How much are you picking up? None. Oh, wait. No, 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 no. See, this is the thing. You need to... No, no, no. You need to wait until full. Not turn your ass around. Um, you need to wait unlimited for now. And then this train needs to wait until full, unlimited. This will help us um, stop losing so much money so quickly. And this is, right, and you will wait until full, unlimited. And then you will wait until full. Uh, unlimited. When you get to the first station where the pickup is, I'll send you on your way. And we'll go from there. Alright, so now that they're actually waiting, they won't be costing so much money. Um, because they will be running uh, full. How old are you? You're not that old. You should have an auto replace kind of thing going to 10, 8 million in the hole. That's fine. It's going to be okay. I promise it's going to be all right. 
I say that now, but then... <laughs> They gotta go to one station each. They gotta go to one side each because then it'll tell them, hey, you know, they need fuel, they need this, they need that, and then it'll go. And right, we're down to. It's gonna, it's gonna be like this for a little bit. That's why we're just kind of sitting around. See now, it's not costing very much because it's not running constantly. Why are you still sitting here? Wait a minute. What's going on? No, 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 no. Oh. Okay, gotcha. Well, we don't have any money. Well, we will. Borrow it. Okay. Borrow it and then pause. Uh, right. Okay. Let's do this real quick. Uh, let's say... I'm going to go this way with it. Uh, go away. Uh, uh gonna work. I'm not sure why that that the fuel train sitting there ain't gonna help us out. <laughs> so I, I don't know what it was thinking. All right, so if we go this way. So if we were to say, all of this is good like this. No, that's a, uh, that is too much on the slow side if, uh, for my taste, if you don't mind. All right, and then we'll do this. And then this, there you go. And we'll say, this is a slip junction. There we go. Ah. Right. Now, if we can just get you to turn around for a moment, go back that way. And then turn around again. That is not what I thought it was. All right. And then... Why are you, what are you waiting on? Oh, for the track to be clear. All right, there you go. Okay, now we should probably be good to go. All right, we need to repay all the money we have. All the money we have, all of it. Okay, we're down nine million plus whatever else we're down from the for the week. <laughs> Come on, you guys need to keep going because we need to be making some more cash. We've got a loan interest of something. Well, we're going to find out what it is anyway. Come on. I need more stuff to be paid off. Alright, so we're running about $3 million a month. $2.5 million a month. I really need this stuff to start paying off. We will have to borrow the money to get the hub train where it needs to go. Oh no, why can't you go? Oh, because you're going the wrong damn way. Oh my goodness gracious. All right, so I need you to go. Uh, oh, don't have it. Pause. Bar, 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 bar. There we go. Um, We'll say we need. No, this is just a waste of money we don't have. But it needs to be done. Alright, so. Da, 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 da. That's okay. I don't want us to slow down too much. If it's at all possible. Um, if 
I make this this like this, then it should be good, right? Right. Okay. Good. All right. So now go. You need to um. You need to go because you need to be able to let this guy through. They're, they're just sitting here costing us money. Like, seriously. You're just costing us money now, game. Why would you do that? I'm just going to pay off as much as I can. We're still down about $3 million. But maybe just a little more, too. Apologies. All right. Now what? And now I need you to go do your thing. Right? Mm hmm And then when you come back, you can wait for a full load of stuff. Right. Yes, I know. There's stuff telling me that we need to pay stuff off. But I think I'm pretty sure that it's, uh... Oh, I guess. Okay. Well, the blue line. Damn! The blue line, the kernel, the fail lines. Uh, there's a lot of stuff that needs to be replaced. Uh, we just don't have the cash to do it. That's why I need this stuff to start paying off. Oh my gosh. Alright, I need you to go get sold. We will do const we'll do food and stuff later. Let's focus on the fuel. Let's get that thing going over there. Let's get fuel going over there. We'll send the construction materials train and stuff back to the depot. Um, no vehicles on that yet. Uh, we'll sell that one off. Ooh, there we go. All right, everything. The loan's paid back off again. That's good. That's the best part of the whole thing. Okay, so that train got sent back. We're not going to worry about that. We're going to worry about just the fuel right now. Um, the other thing we need to do is we need to send... What are you? Where's the fuel train? Well, that's definitely not it. Where is it at? It's got to be somewhere. Is it all the way down here? It is, and it just made us 1.15 million. All right, that's not bad. Okay, so... Fuel is doing its thing. I need those trains to come back, like, pronto. And then you're over here. Are you at Hampton yet? No? Are you on your way back? You're on your way back. Okay, and you're going to wait. Right, so now we need the money to make uh, the train to go hub to hub. Right. Sorry about the kind of camera jiggery pokery thing here going on. Um, we need more money. I need money to start happening. 3.39 million this year so far. It's not bad. Um, we don't get money starting to happen here really shortly. I'm going to have to borrow the money to get to make the train. I'm, I'm not happy, folks. I'm not happy. Come on, it's the end of January. Still making us money? Yeah, but not much. It's the blue line needs to be replaced. How much? Alright, so... Sixteen point nine million, and we don't have that, but we're gonna have to borrow it. No, oh, you're not gonna just sit there and eat up my money. Like, get out of here. Replace, and then start making us some cash. All right, back into the. Oh, 
Uh, I'm hoping. Oh, they're, they're whining and crying because of what? Oh, the blue line can handle more passengers than what I think that it can handle. So that means we have to put more cars on there. Put two more on there. Replace. It's going to cost us another four million. All right, well, let's stop it and borrow the money because otherwise it's going to eat it before we can do anything with it. Yes. All right. So that's should definitely be making us some money. If not, we're in trouble. We're going to keep it going. Trying to put in all those trains uh, into service at one time was not the smartest idea. I mean, these are nice, and they're just sitting here. So they're only costing us, well, they're costing us $2 million a year just to sit there. So that's $4 million a year just to sit there. All right, so let's see what's going to happen here. Yep, definitely got stuff coming up. Right. And where's the there it is, it's the fuel train. And how much are you gonna pay us? Hopefully something good. Can't afford to take any more losses. Aha. And we're gonna repay all of that. Oh, that wasn't bad actually. How much did you pay? Ooh. Six million, but I got a three million profit. That's not bad. That's actually pretty good. Actually, pretty happy with that. We're still down now. So it's about three million a month that we're paying. This is definitely way over the time of the episode, but I'd really like to get the loan paid down. Before we have this twenty million dollars, Nexus. I don't think it's gonna happen there, buddy. Uh, uh, let's see. That's one, that's five hundred thousand, and next. Oh, I'm gonna get it again for the end of the month. Alright, well, it was you know, it was worth a shot while it lasted. Alright, so what's the problem here? Why aren't you going out here? Because there's not a damn signal out here, too. Oh, I can't even afford a signal. That's bad. Okay, so borrow the money again. All right, we want to put a signal here. Right. And then put a signal here. Right, okay. That's bad. Okay. <laughs> Sitting here waiting for the train because there's no signal for a mile and a half, two miles down the track. That's bad. It cannot be sitting there for that long. It's ridiculous. It already cost us 1.5 million already this year just because it was sitting there for so long. Let me pay this down. I don't think we're going to make it down to past the 20 million. Uh, anyway, that's going to, I think that's going to wrap it up for this time. Uh, thank you very much for joining me. If you enjoyed this one, please leave a like and a comment. Uh, hit the thumbs up button and the red subscribe button if you've not done so already. Uh, the chaos only grows from here, as I keep saying. Uh, I've been Nexus, and this has been Transport Fever. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll catch you in the next one. I'm going to finish this off, uh, making sure that we get into profit again by, before, the end of, uh, before the next time that I see you. And uh, hopefully we'll have everything in order and ready to go. So uh, catch me next time and uh, subscribe so that you don't miss out. Peace out.